The benefits of colonoscopy screening for reducing the risks of colorectal cancer and related death are unclear. A new trial assessed the 10-year effects of colonoscopy screening on those clinical endpoints. In this population-based pragmatic randomized trial, 84,585 men and women, 55 to 64 years of age, who lived in Poland, Norway, and Sweden, and who had not previously undergone screening, were randomly assigned in a 1 to 2 ratio either to receive an invitation to undergo one-time colonoscopy screening or to receive usual care with no invitation to screening. Among those invited to colonoscopy screening, 42% participated. Primary endpoints to be assessed at median follow-ups of 10 and 15 years were the risks of colorectal cancer and related death. After 10 years of follow-up, the risk of colorectal cancer was 0.98% in the invited group and 1.20% in the usual care group. And the risk of death from colorectal cancer was 0.28% and 0.31%. In adjusted per protocol analyses, the risk of colorectal cancer was 0.84% in the invited group and 1.22% in the usual care group and the risk of death from colorectal cancer was 0.15% and 0.30%. The authors estimate that 455 participants would need to be invited to undergo screening to prevent one case of colorectal cancer. A secondary endpoint of death from any cause occurred at similar rates in the two groups. The authors conclude that in men and women 55 to 64 years of age, who had not previously undergone screening, the risk of colorectal cancer over 10 years was lower among participants who were invited to undergo screening colonoscopy than among those who were assigned to no screening. Full trial results are available at NEJM.org.